Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of my Clash of Clans play series. And today we are finishing up the collectors as we uh, found out in the previous episode. Actually, take a while uh, if you max them out at level town hall level 2. So these are going to take an hour each. Uh, I am going to do actually a gold first to make sure that I can get the last two walls that we need done. So there's one wall. There's the other. And that is it. We have max everything except for collectors now. So let us go with the elixir collector. And let us go on to our first attack. I will see you guys once I find a good base to raid. Alright, so here we go. Um, this base is not an easy base to raid by any means. But uh, the... Collectors and the storages are on the outside, so it is going to be a very easy resource uh, base. So we're just going to spread out our barbarians. Um, they might have been spread too thin. I'm not sure because, again, you have so little troops at this town hall level that this may be a little too thin. But we're going to take as much as we can. There was a clan castle, which, again... If I was going for 3 stars, that would mean I would fail, but I'm not going for 3 stars, I'm going for only loot. And it does look like we are going to take the majority of it. We gain, I think, 2,000 gold, which is a decent amount. Yep, 2,200 uh, gold, which is a very good amount at this town hall level. But, uh, it was a fail, so I will see you guys in the next attack. Alright, so this looks like a pretty decent base to attack. Um, again, I will be going straight for the collectors. Uh, if you can tell on the left, it is an even amount. So that means there is nothing in the, uh, storages. It is all in the collectors. As you can see, these are dark purple, which means they are completely full. And there's probably a thousand inside of the town hall, uh, maybe. But when it's a complete even amount, it is most likely all inside of these uh, collectors. So I will send 20 over there and 10 over here. Because these ones are a little bit less out of range of that cannon. And yep, I was right. It was 100% in the collectors. So that's just stuff you need to pay attention to when you are raiding. Uh, look at where the loot is. If it's in the collectors, go for the collectors. Don't go for the storages, because these literally have nothing in them. So I'm actually just going to end the battle here, because again, there's nothing in those storages that they're attacking. So there we go. There's a pretty nice raid at this town hall level. Um, 7.8 thousand resources. Uh, it was a defeat, but again, that doesn't matter. So I'm going to wait for these two collectors to upgrade. And I will be back for the next two. Alright, so fast forwarding a little bit, my two elixir collectors did get done to level 4. As you can see, they are max level for this town hall level. And I did start up the other two collectors. And we do have a full army camp, so I will go back and find another raid for us to get doing. Wow, get doing. I meant get done. <laughs> but uh, here is a decent amount of loot. Um, however, their defenses are pretty much... Higher than my troops can handle. These are level 3 can, Or at least. It's one level 2 cannon. One level 3 cannon. And one level 3 archer tower. So let's see if we can do it. I'll have to send 10 on each. Hopefully we don't fail this one. There's 10 right there. 10 right there. And then we have to find the sweet spot. For that cannon. There isn't going to be one. So we have to just send in their 10 right there. And hope for the best. Looks like they aren't going to be able to take out this level 4 cannon. It's maybe. It's a pretty high level for my troops being level 1. Can these three barbarians do it? Oh, they did it! Let's see, can these... What is that? Three or four? Three barbarians take out this level 2 cannon. Getting it close. There's one left. However, it is distracted enough to have my other troops run through and destroy this barracks. And hopefully they'll go for the cannon. Alright, sweet. So this is an easy 3-star. Well, not easy, but uh, it is cutting it pretty close. So I am just going to fast forward through the rest while they go through and destroy this base.
Alright, so down goes the last building. It did cut it pretty close there. If you saw, there is only about 20 seconds left. But we did get out with around 8,000 in total of loot, even though, as you saw in the upper right, probably the entire time, my stuff was actually pretty full since the beginning of the raid. But I did want the 3-star, because that was an easy 22 trophies. So, let's get back to base, because that is going to be it for this episode. We have full uh, storages, and we still have about 40 minutes on our buildings to upgrade. So that's pretty much it that we can do today. Once those are done, the next episode I will start out with Town Hall upgrading to level 3, and we will be uh, building the additional buildings that we get from finally being Town Hall level 3. Uh, let me know if you guys are enjoying this series. I'm. Let me know if you think I am hovering around the Town Hall levels, or the early Town Hall levels, too much in the videos themselves. Uh, let's get some, some gems right there. Uh, because this has been probably about 10 episodes for level Town Hall level 2. Um, however, uh, if I, if this is going to be a long running series, it kind of has to be that way. Um, if I just skip through everything and not show you guys what I do in order, it kind of defeats the purpose of my idea of this let's play. So let me know, because feedback is always taken into consideration. Uh, even if my idea was something different than what you guys say. Um, I can't guarantee that I'll follow everything in the comments. Again, this is kind of what I envision with my let's play to be. But, again, let me know you guys' feedback. But, besides that, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember, leave a like on it if you want to see more of these Clash of Clans videos. And I will see you guys next time.